background. Now that you're a candidate, a very important role for this election in particular, for you who's no stranger to the political arena, but as a candidate, you know, we would like to know more about Tatiana, who's Tatiana, her work experience, her education, and so much more that you can share with us. I started my career uh, as a senior administrative worker in the island secretary office and then <laughs> with you know with hard work and, and supporting the commissioners at that time uh, I was asked by uh, minister at that time Theo Heilegger to join his cabinet and uh, the rest has been history and we're still going strong. <laughs> and of course, you know, stranger to another cabinet as well, the former um, Minister of Public Works, you're also part of that cabinet. In that role, what did you, you hold in that particular cabinet? I think that's correct. So I, I, I've been part of three cabinets within the Ministry of Romi. Um, the first run at it, I was uh, Executive Secretary, and after that, uh, Public relations was added to my portfolio as well. And why the United People's Party? Why would you run on the United People's Party? I know you've been a board member, you're, you're passionate about St. Martin, but what stands out in terms of the United People's Party for you? Well, for me, my motivation behind choosing the UP Party, besides always working with the UP Party, um, I think my three kids, as a single mom, I had to look and see what was going on in St. Martin and, and of course envision and, and, and try to form the St. Martin that I would like my kids to inherit. And if you look at the other parties, planning is everything, vision is everything. And um, the United People's Party, that is the only party that I see. Uh, we work with planning, nothing is done without planning, nothing is done without a vision. Um, and, you know, without a vision, people perish. The Up Party, as you know, came up with the slogan, all the way up. What does that tell you um, as a candidate? Well, when I hear the word up, I think of growth, I think of equality, I think of um, sustainability, I think of empowerment, and that is what, you know, those are the things that I will be working on as a candidate hopefully elected in, um, into Parliament. And what are the goals you bring to the table then for St. Martin? Um, being, of course, not only a candidate, but someone who will most likely have a, a good run in this campaign. Well, one of the slogans that I have, that I've been living by and I've also taught to my kids is do good when no one is looking. I think that is a philosophy that I will also take with me. Um, even when the cameras are, are off and the lights are off, I'm still going to be working for the people of St. Martin. I hold very close to me my parents, which are now senior citizens. They will kill me for saying that, but they are. Um, I also hold close like my kids and single moms, single parents on a whole. So that, those are the, the people that I'm going to be working hard for. And, and like I said, you know, I've, I've done it when no one is looking and now that people are looking, it will be no different. I will, I promise to give you a Tatiana, we thank you for coming on the program. Update. Thank you for having me. We all the way up.